Countries around the world are investing heavily in infrastructure to support economic growth, ensure energy security, and address climate change. Whether adapting existing infrastructure assets or building new ones, the task at hand is massive. In fact, engineering firms have more work than they can handle. The best way the infrastructure sector can increase capacity is by going digital, leveraging technology to improve efficiency and effectiveness. And this is what is happening in civil engineering, with more and more infrastructure organizations shifting their processes to digital delivery. Let's hear more about it from François Valois, VP Civil Infrastructure at Bentley. Welcome, François. How does digital delivery change the game in infrastructure engineering? Well, thank you, Nicolas. Great question. In civil engineering, uh, digital delivery means uh, a model-based approach to deliver on a project. Um, so this allows to reduce cost and improve quality of the work when optimizing the asset management downstream. It means essentially using a model and data for a paperless, streamlined process that enables collaboration across the entire lifecycle. One of the challenges is that there's no way to really validate the 3D models in an engineering way. There's no way to ensure that the 2D drawings and 3D models are in sync. So you really never know if your drawings and your models are the same. Bentley is addressing these challenges through our unified digital project delivery. So we're enabling first validation of the model using civil engineering techniques. So we can check, for example, the super elevation, the bridge clearance, highest point, and so on. So a lot of different techniques that help make the model right. We also link the 2D model and the 3D model in one data package. And this data can then be distributed downstream. So making sure that everyone understands the data. There are multiple benefits, one of which is a 20 to 30% design process improvement, right? So it makes the design process better because you can check issues early. And it also helped reduce the environmental impact of these projects by allowing to link the 3D models with embodied carbon calculation engines. We're essentially allowing the whole industry to do more with less in that context. So this is very, very key here. Digital delivery is one of the cornerstone change that the industry is taking to really addressing the labor shortage challenges and improving quality and absolutely helping bridge our gap in terms of infrastructure deficit in that context. So that's a key corner to the technology there. This is just one of the many ways we're supporting the infrastructure sector to achieve greater efficiency in planning, design, and construction delivery. Merci, François.